in another episode of Why Do We Buy Toys. Giddy up. Giddy up. Giddy up. Giddy up. Hey girl. So I wrapped our first Christmas gifts of the season for our friends Dominic and Sophia. They're another set of twins that, if you watched our vlogs this summer, they were here to visit. And I thought the little wrappings turned out pretty darn cute. I love putting a little stuffed animal on gifts for little kids. And I think I found them on Amazon. They're, there's like a pack of 12 for $7.99 or something. And they just add a lot and make it fun and it's like an extra little gift. So I'll leave a link for those in the description below. Brad will. Do you feel special? Yes. Yeah. We had a bunch of people send us some cards and, oh my gosh. and a Hogwarts advent calendar. So. Sorry we did not return the sentiment. <laughs> yeah, we didn't do a Christmas card this year. We didn't. This will probably be the only year in our existence that we don't do one. It's not too late. Yes, it is. It's not. Yes, it is. It's not too late. We might do a digital. Really? Yeah. We spent like over half of a thousand dollars last year. Well said. On Christmas cards. <laughs> <laughs> on sending out Christmas cards, which was our pleasure to do. We just can't really do that every year. <laughs> right? We can't? We can't. It's, it was a lot of work. It was also a lot of work. Brad did it all. Yes. But I, I saw it go yes, down. I did. yes, I did. So I'm thinking maybe digital Christmas cards would be better. So le leave us a comment below if you want a digital Christmas card. I'll design it. Well, they need to email us their email. Well, leave a comment below of your email address. Some people don't feel comfortable doing that. Okay, or you could email it to us. Either one. <laughs> okay, the kids are in bed. I'm about to do a little self-care. So I have an oatmeal cream pie. I have my detox mask, the green tea blend from Teamy. And I also have, I don't know if you guys have heard of these. It's a bath bomb, but for showers. So I don't always like to take a bath in the kids' bathtub because there's a bunch of toys in it and it's right next to Bear's room. So they actually make bath bombs that you can put in the shower. I don't know where I have been, but I just discovered them today. I don't know how long they've been around. What I'm gonna do for my self care is eat this oatmeal cream pie, do my detox mask, take a shower with my bath bomb, my shower bomb. So what's great about this mask is that you can see results after just one use. That's huge because I don't have time to do a mask every day. I don't even have time to do it multiple times a week. Even just one use, you're gonna see a difference. So issues that I have with my skin are some red areas basically in my t-zone here so i don't know if you can see especially right here this has always been an issue for me it's like a stork bite type mark and i'm always having to conceal it but i've noticed that using this green tea mask all of those like hyperpigmented areas and red areas immediately calm down after using the mask so i'll show you how it works so you just apply a thin layer of the mask on it doesn't take very long at all and then you let it dry so I'm gonna show you how it goes on. As you guys know, I'm extremely busy. I have three kids under the age of two. I also work part-time. I work two and a half days a week. And by the time we get the kids in bed, I'm exhausted and I really don't have time for a full-on skincare routine most nights. I'm getting better. But one thing that's great is like I said before, you can just do one treatment with this mask and you notice a big difference in your skin. It can just sort of reset things for you. As I'm applying this, it feels luxurious and wonderful. It's very cooling. It has a cooling sensation to it. And it just feels, I don't know, like I'm giving myself some love here. Almost forgot I need to be eating my oatmeal cream pie. And what's really important for me, because I have somewhat dry skin, is that this doesn't dry your skin out even more like some face creams or masks can do. So you can use it if you do have the time. You can use it two or three times a week and that's perfectly fine. It's not gonna dry your skin out by doing that. So it's also perfect for all skin types. So I mentioned my skin is dry. It is okay if your skin is oily, you can still benefit from it. The, the ingredients in it are just very gentle on the skin and help reduce inflammation. 
So the active ingredients that really work well are the matcha, the lemongrass, and the clay. Those are the components that really help with inflammation. They also have some antimicrobial properties, so pretty awesome for the skin. And now we let it dry. Cheers. Hey. How do I look? Like the Grinch. Oh, really? Or Shrek. It's nice and cool. I know. It it's is very cooling. Yeah. It's anti-inflammatory. It was great. Have you done a face mask before? No, I've never done a face mask Isn't before. it nice? It is nice. Hmm. So now that it's dried, I'm gonna rinse it off and I'll show you those problem areas and how instantly they're better. So right away, I can already tell a difference. Things are just calmer, smoother, less red, less inflamed. And more importantly, my skin just feels really good, really clean, really soft. You can get 30% off if you just follow the link in the description below, and there's a discount code that you can use. You just plug in BR30, and you're gonna get 30% off this face mask. So do yourself a favor, or if you know a new mom, or if you know an expecting mom, this would be a perfect gift for somebody like that. You know, some of the most cherished gifts that we got at a surprise shower that we had when I was pregnant with Eloise were things that were with the idea of me having self-care in mind. You know, when you have everything for your kids, it's really nice to get something for the mother or for the parents. So this is a great gift that you can give somebody who's expecting maybe a second or third child or just a mom that you know is overwhelmed with being in the trenches of having toddlers. I know I appreciate doing this and it's something that's quick and small that I can do for myself that just makes a huge difference in how I feel. So check it out in the description below. And thank you to Teamy for sponsoring today's video. A little sneak peek. We can't show our address. <laughs> oh! <laughs> That says Penny and Sparrow. That the mail is being received from. She only ate four ounces today all day. I know Ooh. So she's gonna be Nursey McNurser soon. Yes, yeah, she is. So yes, this is a sneak peek. Are you, when are you gonna show it? Not until then. Uh, we're definitely gonna wait until the nursery I'm reveal. I was wondering if I could even say that. Yeah, we, I think I've said that before. Oh, okay. We're so cryptic. It's gonna be awesome. What do you guys do today? What do you have on your shirt, Lindell? Oh. Hearts. Good job. Bear, what do you have on your shirt? Bear. <laughs> That's right, Lindell. Bear's got a bear. Man, you slammed that grape juice. Was it good? Yeah. <laughs> well, we're going to go outside because Daddy needs to wash the car. One of the bad things about living in a climate that has snow and ice is all that stuff gets on your car. Um, so, I'm gonna go rinse the car off. I don't really want the kids to get into the water, but I want them to come outside with me, so we'll see how it goes. Lindo got a blowout last night. It looks so pretty. Can, Can you turn, turn around, Lindo? Turn and show Daddy your back. Turn around. Oh, wow. Look how pretty it is. <laughs> There's so much body. That's pretty, Lindell. Is your hair pretty? Is it as pretty as mommy's? <laughs> yes. Yes. Got started on the car washing. It's like 50 degrees out. Not too shabby. Looks like I got a little leak there in the power washer. But you can tell quite the difference and I, I'm not gonna scrub it or anything. I mean, this is a Prius. Is that funny? Yeah. Funny. Yeah, it's a Prius. It's not like I need it to look good. It just needed to be functional. Funny, funny. It is funny, isn't it? How does the sunset look, guys? Good. Good? Is it pretty? Yes. Yeah. Pretty. Is that a pretty sunset? Yes. Yeah. Do you guys want to go for a dadua? Yeah. <laughs> they still call it a dadua. I don't know why. Let's go, Rusty. I'm running. Yeah, Rusty's running. Let's go, bud. Come on. Rusty is a boy, yes. So say that again. Mommy's a girl. What's daddy? Boy. Oh, yeah, there's a squirrel. Rusty likes to chase squirrels. We're just barking.
Rusty's gonna freak out when we get closer. How many other guys? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven guys. Seven. 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 Should we let Rusty chase them? Yes. No. <laughs> giddy up. Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, up, up. <laughs> so this is a box that we just got in the mail from our friends. You're making me nervous. Oh, thank you. Be soft. Be so soft. They're in a diaper box. That's hilarious. Be nice. Yeah. Apparently the, the gifts are wrapped inside here. But if we open that up, those two. Yeah, you guys, you know how to open presents. We cannot put presents underneath the tree yet. Because you'll open them. Open it. Open it. <laughs> Maybe next year we'll be able to. Yeah. Yeah. Is she sleeping? Man, she's tired. Be, you gotta be so soft. Yeah, be soft. Yeah, baby Eloise is taking a nap. Yeah. Are you being really soft? Be really, be really soft with her. Beep, beep. Be soft. Does she have a booger? I don't see one. <laughs> you guys are really cute. I can't believe she's sleeping through this. Is that Eloise? Is that your baby sister? Do you guys remember what it was like before Eloise? <laughs> so just when I think she's getting predictable with her sleeping, she's not predictable at all. She slept for two hours from like four to six, and then it hasn't even been an hour and she's already asleep again. Like, like very firmly asleep. Hey Bear, I don't, I really don't think she wants to see that truck. You got your baby, honey? Yes. What's your baby's name? Budget. What is it? A present. <laughs> a present? A present? Yes. Her name is Present? Yes. I love it. That's well, a beautiful name. Present Engelbarts. Beautiful. Bear Engelbarts. <laughs> Bear Engelbarts. Present Engelbarts. It's like present. Yeah. Ready? <laughs> I wonder where they learned that. Boom. Oh, did you hear my knee pop? That was your knee? You want to bump bellies? <laughs> okay, come on, please. <laughs> That's my other knee. Oh, that was your knee. <laughs> We're getting old. We're so old. <laughs> we can't even bump bellies without our knees breaking. <laughs> Boom. I wonder where they learned it. I don't know. Oh, now you want to bump bellies, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Daddy's got enough belly to go around. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> that was a good one. Come here. Boom. Little, come here. You're a good belly bumper. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Boom. What the heck are we doing? <laughs> I don't know. You're bump bellies. Oh, okay. <laughs> Boom! Boom! Do you want to bump bellies with each other? Oh! Bump bellies! Oh, denied! Denied! Here, Linda, I'll bump bellies with you. <laughs> <laughs>